Um, next question is from our best friend, Fede. <laughs> uh, so he said he wants to follow the seven steps to writing a good headline um, checklist when writing uh, headlines or subject lines. But he said, obviously, there's not that much space in the subject line. So which of these seven do you avoid or focus on most? And obviously, um, you wrote it, but for the people who don't know, it's curiosity, calling out pain points, promising solutions, specificity, simplicity, credibility, and addressing skepticism, and then the time frame to achieve the results of the promise. So obviously, it's quite difficult to have all of them in a subject line. So like, how do you think about crafting? Email. Yeah, I mean, I think that for me, it's like almost always simplicity and curiosity are the two most important ones. Um, again, all I really want the subject line to do is get somebody to open, um, right? Well, eh, you know, and probably some kind of like either specificity or calling out the pain point too, or promising a solution. I mean, basically the answer is like, you just do a combination of as many as you can without making it like too long of a subject line. I mean, but like really, because it has to be basically enough curiosity that they're going to open it it should be like relevant enough that they know that it's related to like their a pain point or a problem or something that they're interested in um and then you want simplicity and that you want it to be very succinct um or like you know you want to um like just basically or, or it seems easy right but it's sort of like um three second uh you know whatever like breakfast trick you know uh burns tummy fat fast. It's like, okay, so say that's your thing, right? Well, time frame, three seconds, uh, burns tummy fat. Like, okay, so promising a solution, um, you know, three seconds is also like simplicity, um, you know, hopefully curiosity. I mean, I think it's even that great of a subject line. It's just kind of you seeing you all the time. But the point is, right, it's gonna hit, I don't know, it hits like four of them, right? And so I think you just like look at that way, but ultimately number one thing is curiosity. Um, I really just like really long subject lines. I feel like that those would never work. And then I think, um, again, some kind of like, like relevance, which you could also kind of, you know, synonymously say is like specificity. That's kind of the way I would, I would approach it here. Cool. Yeah. Rock.